Fox News decided to host a rehab interview for J.D. Vance. What do I mean by that? Well, as many of you know, J.D. Vance is painfully unlikable and his uh, unfavorability is high. His favorability is low. So they decided to try to do a let's rehabilitate your image interview on Fox News interviewed by Laura Ingram. It went so terribly wrong so quickly that it almost makes you feel a little bad for J.D., but I don't really feel bad for him because he's absolutely horrible. We've endorsed J.P., right? J.D. Mandel. Here is Laura Ingram doing her best to talk about what a great guy he is and how funny he is. Really, folks, he's so likable, says Laura Ingram. Senator, um, people, are, I guess they do these polls and they say, oh, your favorability isn't as high as Tim Waltz's. You know, there's a gender gap for your ticket compared to uh, Harris and Waltz. Um, uh, how do you go to the dis undecideds at this point, the shrinking pool of people, and, and convince them that not only are you serious and you're seriously smart, but you're a regular person. I've known you for a long time. You're really fun. You're really funny. How do you convince people that you are a member of Homo sapiens just like all of us, despite the way you appear? Um, versus the giggle and vibe show that seems to work for a lot of women voters out there. Right. That's that's a reference to Kamala Harris's laugh, by the way. You know, Laura, my approach to this is just to get out there and meet as many people as possible. And I know this is Donald Trump's approach to one of the funny things is every time he meets people, it goes terribly. Can you tell me how long you have worked in the donut shop? Oh, I've worked here six months. Very good, ma'am. Thank you. I will have a cruller, please. We don't do the scripted stuff. We don't only speak in front of a teleprompter. We actually like to get out there and give some unscripted remarks, some press conferences, and also just you know go out there and, and talk to people. And that's what I'm going to keep on doing, Laura. Uh, I, I don't put much stock in the polls. Yeah, I wouldn't either if they all said I was the least popular <laughs> VP in modern political history. Even the polls that show us ahead, and there are a lot of those these days. Uh, what I put stock in is the wisdom of the American people and the fact that if we go out there, make our case, don't hide behind a teleprompter, but get out there and meet people, the American people are going to elect me and Donald Trump. Uh, I have no doubt about that. We just have to do our work, and we've got 65. Laura, thank you so much for having me on your show to rehabilitate my image today. It's a really strange choice. I mean, Laura Ingram's nuts, nuts and so lacks charisma herself. It's a weird place to launch your I'm a normal person tour in my mind. Um, here is Laura Ingram asking J.D. about his beard. Vance, will you clear this up tonight for everyone watching? Is your beard your best prop? <laughs> hot, 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 hot. Laura, you have told a funny joke as a fellow member of Homo sapiens. I recognize it with this laugh. Um, it was just all it was all terrible. It was really, really bad. And eventually J.D. kind of got to why Donald Trump is so great and everything he said is untrue. And I think that if we want to fix that recruitment problem, the best thing we can do is reelect Donald J. Trump. People trust his leadership. They right. also know that a military led by Donald Trump is about what unites us as Americans. And it's not about this ridiculous uh, division of Kamala Harris. Yeah. You know, it doesn't strike me that it would be logical for one to say now that Trump won, I am going to go and join the military. And the, the division that J.D. is talking about is what Trump has been stoking. You go to, you know, a Harris Walls event and it's let's build ourselves up. Let's educate. Let's give people freedom and liberty to do the things they want to do and to realize that we are one one human race at the Trump rallies. It's the media is bad. Democrats are bad. These people are Marxists. Those are communists. The military's woke. It, the division is coming. The calls are coming from inside the house is the point I'm trying to make. Um, and then here is J.D. laying it out and saying, oh, yeah, so many people will want to join the military if Trump will. If you're a person thinking about joining the military, you're probably not going to want to sign up if Kamala Harris is the potential commander in chief. Why not? If anything, I mean, listen, 
Kamala Harris has not made foreign policy an extensive part of her campaign so far in a serious way. But one thing that seems pretty clear is Kamala Harris isn't going to certainly do what George W. Bush did and say, hey, you know what, even though Iraq had nothing to do with 9 11, let's just start sending endless troops into harm's way, leading to thousands of American soldier deaths. I don't think Kamala Harris is going to do that. So I don't know what J.D. Vance is talking about. And this attempt at appearing to be a normal person really not working out very well. I try to take my health and fitness seriously, cardio, weights, eating right. You can do all of the right things and have one major pitfall, which is just not knowing how your metabolism is functioning during your workouts. But our sponsor Lumen gives you that power. Lumen is the world's first handheld metabolic coach. It's quite simply a device that measures your metabolism through your breath. And on the app, it lets you know if you're burning fat or carbs, and it'll give you tailored guidance with the goal of improving nutrition, workouts, sleep, and even stress management. None of these cookie cutter, one size fits all nutrition plans. Lumen lets you know what's happening in your body in real time. It builds you a personalized health plan based on your data. For example, right before a workout, you can breathe into your Lumen and it'll tell you, are you burning carbs or fat? And on that basis, Lumen will tell you whether to carb up before your workout for an energy boost or if you're good to go. Using that biofeedback, Lumen can help you get the most out of your workouts. And in the long run, these are changes that can really add up. Go to lumen.me slash Pacman to get 15% off your Lumen. The link is in the description.